Music for me is everything. I can't imagine life without music. Music means a lot to me. I first started playing piano when I was in second or third class. My resource teacher was like, hey, do you want to play an instrument? And I was like, hell yeah, I want to play an instrument. Since then, I just kind of developed a love for it. When I was started to compose when I was like a teenager, I didn't know any other composers. I didn't think it was a thing that anyone did. It would be amazing if we were able to provide something like that for people who were young and like starting out and just wanted other people who, to hang out with who were doing the same thing. I applied to Creative Lab because I felt like it was a opportunity and a next step. It was, for me, it was the first day walking into the National Concert Hall. It was a dream, you know, for me, like it wasn't really happening. And I was like, oh, wow, I actually got picked out of these 10 people to join this music program. So it was, it was amazing for me. The word composer may have connotations to it that might be just associated with classical music. You can make music in any way. You can sit down at the piano and play through melodies or chords, use WhatsApp or some other app to record your voice and sing. All of that is composition. I was very nervous at first because it's a massive building and I was a bit intimidated, but everyone doing the program was really nice and seemed just as scared as I was and it was a bit awkward at first, but then we all kind of got along and I think it's a lovely group of people to be doing this with. The programme has built my confidence in so many ways, like in terms of the music and really taking hold of, you know, what's mine and what I want to create, but also just in general terms, um, it's been such a welcoming place. It's important when you're young to have space to try things and fail. Um, because you learn more from that. Chance to do a lot of things and experiment, they will learn so much more and it'll just kind of provide a pathway for them if they want to have a career in the arts. I found my community of musicians that I can just be myself and express this to them and they'll understand what I mean. So I've absolutely loved it. The webinars were incredible and especially the guitar one stood out for me because we got to see how like different guitar pedals are used and all these different techniques that I'd never really heard of before but I had heard in my favourite songs and I didn't have any clue how they worked and now I do and I'm excited to maybe use some of them in my composition. After the pandemic, like live music is just so valuable. Like some things were amazing and worked like so much better than I thought they would. And then other things I'm like, no, that sounds naff. Like, and so it's so important to have that, um, like as you write in. I'm kind of feeling nervous. Um, really excited, I guess having the opportunity to play in the National Concert Hall is a big deal in itself, never mind perform my own music on the stage. So I'm really excited, yeah. At one point I deleted like half of the song, <laughs> so that was so scary. My heart almost stopped. Um, but yeah, I, I was really glad to just see like all the hard work and all the stressful times. is It's all going to be worth it in the end.
everyone was brilliant and it was so cool to be around like so many talented people and just like know that they're gonna go on to do such cool things as well. I was really amazed by all the performances like because I hadn't heard them before so I'm just still in shock and, and in awe of how incredible it, it just wow like how, how how is that possible? It's taught me how to like be more comfortable with like songwriting and performance. It felt amazing I could like feel the sound like in my soul. It's something to imagine something in your head with the instruments and it's another thing to actually see it all live. It was amazing. Just like the whole concert, all of it. I'm definitely going to keep writing music and I write songs for my voice as well. So I'm going to continue with that. And I'm really hoping to compose more music for like orchestras and piano and flute and different instruments. And this was like an amazing introduction to that. And it's like probably a one in a lifetime experience. Thank you.